Hello leaders, welcome, welcome. In this video, we are working on combat. Um, our ammo strikes this time is Tiger, it is Scorpion, and it is um, Prairie Dog. So let's jump in, let's have some fun. Step one, remember, don't hold to the bottom. We talk about all the time, remember, hold the top of the weapon. Hey, the biggest thing, if a lot of our high ranks are like, I've seen this before. Yes, so you're gonna see some strikes year to year. The goal is to get exposed the first year, do it again and get better and better and better. So if you know these strikes, your goal is to work on how you use the weapon. Don't let it swing behind you. So let's jump in. Hey, so back up, yeah. At home, I should practice this. If you want to find a line, whether it's on the carpet or I have a mat right here or the hardwood or tiles, you name it. Try to start a line that's gonna help you figure out how to move effectively. So we are gonna work on Tiger first. Tiger uses a line one motion and a line two motion. Those are the only thing you strike, so you're gonna do. You're gonna do about three. Okay, so from here, you're gonna throw your back leg at an angle. Okay, don't go too wide, because you have to make that angle back. So you jump and you strike. From here, you're gonna lift the weapon up and jump and strike. Jump and strike. That's reset. So in class, we've been talking about same foot, the way it jumps, you hit that way. Don't hit against it, that's panther. Dip and strike. Strike again. Lift one. Two, one. Uh, one more time. So let's go a little faster. It's one, two, one. And then you reset. Okay, if you notice, every time I reset, I'm not turning around. I don't want to throw my back because if I turn my fist back, they can bop me in the head. We don't want that. Okay. The second strike is scorpion. Scorpion here. You're using not one and two, you're using five and six. So you're going up and up. The purpose of scorpion is to knock the weapon out of the way. And then you hit the leg or hand or rib or so. Yeah, so here, I do five to move the weapon. My left leg move around, and then I will strike. Okay. If you notice, I'm still trying to look this way. I'm not doing that. I still want to be able to see you. So five, six, reset. One more time. Five, six, reset. Last one. This one actually my favorites. I do a lot of time when I combat spar. So attacks me, I try to block and go. Okay. So, there's about four steps to do this. Step one is turn the weapon. If you notice, my arm is on the straighter side, I'm not bent. If I spar here and I turn, and I try to block, I'm gonna get poked before I block anything. So here, you turn, you're gonna clear. Okay, the reason my weapon is down, if I block here, I'm gonna get stuck on the way around. If I block, move here, I can collapse it and strike around. Again, turn the weapon down, I step back, I put, put my bottom out so they can't poke my lead leg or my chest. I clear and I step out and strike. Once again, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. One more time, we're bouncing. Go, four. Hey ya! Just like that. Awesome. And those are three animal strikes. Jeff, good day. Hey, Jay.